Hi, I'm in Duluth, and I'm with Mike. He's the food and beverage manager here at Famous Dave's. And I wanted to have Mike tell us a little bit about the history of the store and uh, his history with the company. Uh, well, the store opened in 2002. We started as Shack Style, and uh, I was here for the opening. I did went through all the training, and I started out as a cook. Um, I worked my way through the ranks. Uh, we, went, we were shack style for about a year and a half, and I cooked through most of that, and then we changed into a full service fan space after that. And uh, I was promoted to kitchen supervisor, and then from kitchen supervisor, I was promoted to the kitchen manager, and then from kitchen manager, I was promoted to the front of the house manager, or food and beverage manager. And I've been here ever since, and I've loved it ever since the day I stepped in here and started cooking. So. Um, I'm a big fan of barbecue, maybe not quite as big as you are, but I, know. <laughs> I do love it. I've been with the company for seven years, so I really love it here. Um, the building itself, we moved into, it used to be a place called Willie's Garage. It's just kind of a, a counter service, burgers and fries joint, um, and then it was, I don't think it was doing so well, so uh, our franchise owners, Charlie Torgerson and Randy Jernberg, they uh, came in at the right time and snatched the place up and got this great building and a great part of a beautiful city here in Duluth. Um, this building actually used to be uh, part of the shipping industry and they built ships that are, are on the harbor right now um, in this building. Yeah. So it's got a, got a lot of history and got a lot of uniqueness to it. I, I have photos from a visit when I went on a fishing trip up here in 1978, and uh, this area was gravel at that time, and you guys, they've obviously upgraded since then quite a bit. And sure. No famous saves back then at all. No. So I'm really glad that you're here now. So, yeah. Uh, my first I, inkling that there might be something unique about famous saves was that I went to the main clothes store, and then I came up here, and they were drastically different, and yet, okay. you know, same food. But yep. the architecture and everything was just way different. And, sure. And I like the spirit of the place. And it was shack style the first time I came up here. Okay. But um, how was the transition from shack to full service? It was real smooth. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we had a staff on that was uh, had been with the company for most of the time that we were shack style. So everybody was real comfortable with the menu. Um, and it was, didn't take too much to do transition over into the full service. Everybody had a a great head on their shoulders and it was easy to re really easy to work with. So. You have pretty good retention, I would imagine. We do, yeah. We have a really good uh, rate for people to stick around. We have a lot of employees who are five, six years. Um, most of them, I would say, are between three and four years. Uh, Duluth being a college town, uh, we have a lot of college students that <laughs> work here and it's a great place to have a job as a college student. So um, they usually stick through their college career here and get them for four or five years, so it's great. That's excellent. Yeah. Now you're the only thing that stays with the baker for a while, yeah? Yeah. I think this was here before we moved in, I believe, oh, yeah. since it was Willie's garage. Um, there's a garage theme in a lot of famous days, and that, it kind of, we think we kept a lot of the stuff they have in the walls here, so it just tied in perfectly with what we're trying to go with here. Yeah, and then we can change that. Yeah. And, and you have an arcade. Yes. Yeah, we're connected to, uh, in the same building, we're connected to a place called Carmel Thrills, where a huge arcade. Uh, they got a tilt a whirl, a roller coaster, uh, mini golf. So, we're a fa definitely family oriented. Uh, famous day is they don't have a bar in here even, so it's all families that come in and they bring their kids in to play next door while the parents can sit and chat and have dinner here while they're up away and somebody else can babysit them for them, you know? <laughs> Pretty excellent. And right over there you have a bridge. Tell me about that bridge. Uh, that is the famous Duluth lift bridge. Um, I'll have some footage of that later. Today. Okay. That, that was erected in 1890, I believe, um, and it's kind of a staple of the city. Uh, it's down here for all the tourists to enjoy. It's what connects a peninsula called Park Point from the mainland of Minnesota, and uh, there's a harbor that runs through it, a canal, and that's where all the main iron iron ore shipping goes through, right through there and uh, underneath the bridge there. So. Uh, were you going? Were you uh, going to college when you started working here? Yep. 
Yep, I uh, came to Duluth in 1999, and I went to UMD, went there for business management, which coincided with my job here, and uh, I fell in love with the city, and I've stayed here ever since, so it's a great place to live. Yeah, I can see sticking around. Yeah, love the place. Yeah, there's a lot to do, a lot, a lot of outdoor activities, there's a uh, lake is basically my magnet. I love being around Lake Superior, and just going up the North Shore on a beautiful scenic drive, or kayaking on the Brule River, or just anything outdoors. My, my gig in Duluth is perfect town. And this is the perfect food to go with it. Absolutely. You get yeah. a lot of carry out and take out the people. Yep, you know. yep. Uh, yeah. We've even had people who have parked their boats over in the harbor and we've delivered to people who just sitting right out there on the boats and we'll drop food down for them. And so it's kind of neat. Beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, Mike, thank you very much. It's a pleasure to have you here. Good luck with the rest of your journey. I appreciate it, and uh, I'll, I'll meet it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Today everybody's been great, so it's a lot of fun. Good to hear. Good thank to you hear. very much. Yeah, thank right. you.